sustainability, ingenuity, and initiative have come together in outstanding fashion for a group of Boise State students known as Greenspeed. And the reward for their efforts was an invitation to exhibit at the prestigious Washington, D.C. Auto Show. I think when we started this club, we had no, we couldn't envision possibly what this would, what it would become and the momentum that it would carry us to D.C., the biggest auto show. I mean, a dream come true, really, for many of us because we're all so into cars and gearheads and, and we're so, you know, excited about the truck and the project and we had, it's just an incredible opportunity um, to showcase what we've done. What they've done is build a high performance racing truck from scratch. And not just any truck, but a truck that showcases the potential of alternative fuels, in this case, vegetable oil. Our biggest innovation so much isn't the technology in the truck. The truck is more of just a mechanical means of demonstrating what biofuels can do, even in their raw form, which is pure vegetable oil, like what you go to the grocery store and you pick up off the shelf. We're taking that oil and pushing it to the limit and going, and going after a 200 mile an hour plus record of speed. And so we're showcasing an energy source, not so much a technology. Greenspeed recently shattered the speed record in the vegetable oil fueled vehicle category, posting a speed of 155 miles per hour during a sanctioned run in the Mojave Desert. Ultimately, they hope to make a run at the 215 mile per hour record for petroleum fuel trucks within their division. Greenspeed was the brainchild of engineering student Dave Schenker, who eventually recruited several other students and steered the club through numerous obstacles. Lending a guiding hand is Boise State professor John Gardner, who admires the ingenuity that this student group has shown. The skills that they've learned and that they've, they've tapped in their own, their own skill set uh, are, are those same skills. He's, Dave's an entrepreneur. He, you know, he has an idea, he believes in it, he believes in himself, and he went and found the people that can help him make that happen. And that's exactly, to my mind, the definition of entrepreneurship. And the accomplishments of Greenspeed help shine a light on the ever-increasing academic profile of Boise State University. The success of the Bronco football team and the signature blue turf are well known around the country. But Greenspeed is a tremendous example of what lies beyond the blue at Boise State. The reputation has grown. I've been here about 12 years now. I can't believe how much we've been able to accomplish in those 12 years. Uh, when I left from a big Eastern University to come here, nobody had heard of this place except a few college football fans who knew something about what the turf looked like. But now uh, we're very well known and, 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 and better all the time. So it's just thrilling to be a part of that. But Greenspeed is a student club just a group of students with a lot of drive and determination and, and we proved that, that we could do what we set out to do and that we can take it to the next level and that we can grow and innovate and overcome innumerable obstacles and succeed.